meal plans, uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner niyo. So, ito talaga yung mga foods. Um, mahaba yung listahan, pero pinag pinagpilihan ko na lang. Pag na-screen ko na lang yung mga applicable din sa lugar natin at sa accessibility natin, especially during this pandemic. So, let's start off with number one. Ito mga prutas na to ay napakaganda para makareduce ng high blood pressure. And these are citrus fruits. Okay, specifically, it's a stand out yung grapefruit, oranges, at saka lemons. Marami silang vitamins, minerals, na nagpapabak din ng low, uh, pressure ng blood natin. At saka merong ginanap na Japanese study na kung saan ay may mga tao na every morning nagla-lemon juice sila, so lemon and water, uh, combined with walking during the day at napakaganda daw ng result kasi just from lemon and uh, lemon water and walking they were able to significantly reduce their blood pressure. Sino ba dito mahilig uminom ng uh, tubig na may lemon or tubig na may kalamansi? Ayan. Diba? Very good. So, kung wala kang access sa lemon, we can always use kalamansi. It's also very good. Citrus fruit din yan. And there's also a major benefit to maintaining blood pressure kung tayo ay umiinom ng orange or grapefruit juice. So, kanina nakita ko, Sister Ida, may bawang talaga siyang ano, water with grapefruit and lemon, right? And orange. So, it's nice kasi we can easily slice that up, put it in our water, tapos inumin lang natin. Napakaganda pala yan sa ating blood pressure. It reduces it. Okay, next. Let's move on. Number two. Ito, sa seeds category na naman tayo. Brother Chute, alam ko na napakaganda pala sa ating BP, yung pumpkin seeds. Yeah, so it's a concentrated source of magnesium, potassium, ano pa, arginine, amino acids. At ito, uh, it's, those are all compounds that are needed to produce nitric oxide. Narinig niyo na ba yung nitric oxide? Kailan? <laughs> Just checking if you paid attention kasi tama um, says binanggit ni Doc yan sa kanyang divine message earlier napaka-importante ng nitric acid or oxide rather oxide because um, essentially it's important because it relaxes our blood vessels no? it produces it's able to when you produce nitric oxide kumbaga yung mga molecules na nag nagpapasikip o nagre-restrict ng ating blood vessels parang pinapaalis na yan para makarelax yung ating blood vessels so we want nitric oxide okay gusto natin yan so etong mga pumpkin seeds uh, meron sila ng mga minerals magnesium potassium organ and amino acids na nagpapataas ng nitric oxide nitric yeah, oxide. Ayan. So, pumpkin seeds. Na-try nyo na ba yan? Um, it's not stated here, but I think it's good to include it sa diet as much as you can. <laughs> Baka sobra na yung drink. <laughs> but it's, you know, if you want to sprinkle it, let's say if you bake bread, like I bake bread, I put um, pumpkin seeds sa bread. Or sa cereals, diba? You can add it on top. Um, or eat it raw. Yes, it's also good. Kasi na napakaganda din ang flavor niya, yeah, diba? But then it's a smoothie. Uh-oh. I will go to what other seeds are good. Um, yung third is beans, especially yung mga lentils. So, sino dito mahili kumain, kumain ng bunggo? Diba? Kasama ng papa. Yeah, diba? So, we had bunggo for lunch earlier as well. Yung bunggo, yung mga beans, lentils, rich in fiber siya, magnesium, potassium. See, do you notice a pattern? Magnesium, potassium, palagang pinabagit yan because that's really important for our blood pressure. So, those types of foods really reduce our BP. Tapos, may mga studies na ginawa daw kung saan pinalit, let's say, yung mga main protein sources nila with beans and lentils. At nung pinalit na yun with these, napakaganda ng result gumaba yung blood pressure. Mom, are you listening? <laughs> This is good for you. Okay, so so far we have citrus fruits, pumpkin seeds, and beans and lentils. Number four, berries. Yeah, so if you like berries, yes, especially strawberries, blueberries, uh, blue, um, raspberries. Yeah, 
frozen berries, but then you know they're high. Um, Mango rub. They have so many health benefits. <laughs> benefits actually with berries. Better. What's nice about them is also that they reduce the risk of heart disease um, because of the the factors like high blood pressure that trigger let's say heart disease. Because if we have a BP, natin, it can affect or lead to heart disease in the long term. That's why we want to make sure that our pressure is good in the blood so that we don't develop heart issues and heart diseases. So rich in antioxidants, yung mga berries. If you want something more technical, there are anthocyanins, which is a berry pigment. And it has a nitric oxide. Yeah. So the berries have that compound which will again be able to help our blood vessels relax. No, nasa berries din yun. Ano pa? Balik tayo sa nuts. Number five. This is a green nut. Yes. Pistachios. Very much a green na color. Pistachios are highly nutritious and very nicely um, linked to blood pressure. Among all nuts daw, confirmed by 21 studies, uh, pistachio has the strongest effect on l reducing blood pressure. So, I know it's a little bit of a little bit. Thank you, Daniel. But um, it's a little bit of a blood pressure um, maintenance, especially to reduce it. No? So, let's eat more pistachios if we can. Number six, carrots. Who wow. wow. likes some carrots? Yeah. But it's nice to... Carrot cake, yes. Carrot cake was the first cake for the children I ever baked in my life. So, um, the carrots. There are some phenolic compounds. Ito, medyo technical. Ito, chlorogenic, P, cumaric, caffeine, acid. Lahat ng mga names na to, they help relax the blood pressure for the blood vessels and also reduce inflammation. So, carrots are really good. Mas maganda daw yung benefit sa BP kapag raw yung carrots, sita, versus ito, when it comes to blood pressure. Tapos, um, if you drink, let's say, about 16 ounces or 473 ml of fresh carrot juice for three months, it led to a significant reduction in the systolic blood pressure. Hindi pa siya sa diastolic, pero sa systolic, bumaba talaga. So they had a little bit of carrot juice every day for three months in the study and you know, about the upper number of blood pressure reading. Okay, 